Alright, today I'm going to give you guys a detailed look at this uh, Iron Man 3 Hall of Armor 1-6 scale collectible DS-01 And this is my Hot Toys and here's what the packaging looks like Alright, and here we have the coffin outside of packaging And uh, it comes with a piece of plexiglass and an instruction booklet Well, no, not a booklet, a pamphlet And uh, depending on how many you're buying, if you bought the 7-pack seven, seven um, what you're gonna get is uh, you're gonna get this a hologram sticker sheet. Well, it contains uh, three sets of seven uh, sticker sheets in here. All right, and here are all the batteries you're gonna need to light up one of these uh, coffins here, and uh, two panels. Uh, each one of them will need three AA batteries. And uh, the structure itself will take three AAA batteries. And uh, let's put them in and uh, show you guys what this thing looks like all lit up. All right, here are the batteries, the AA batteries. And uh, basically, you just slot it through these two pieces right here. Same thing with this, these two. So to put it back in, you just slide us through. And it is pretty flimsy. Uh, gotta admit this thing is pretty flimsy so you gotta be very gentle with this otherwise you don't want to break that top off because this it's only attached to the back there uh, nothing on the side so you gotta be careful all right so there are four buttons uh, one down here one over here one over here and one over here all right here's what it looks like all lit up very pretty. All right, and here I have with the plexiglass in, and uh, press that fourth button, and there. Now it's lit up. Pretty nice. So let's bring out my Mark One. All right, and here I have the Mark One inside. Very nice. And here it is without the pexy glass, and uh, as you can see it lit up very nicely. And uh, to put all seven together, uh, basically what you need to do is that each one of these you're going to remove one panel. One of these panel, and then uh, let me show you. And these grooves here, basically what you want to do is slide these out. Same with the one on top. Slide it out, and uh, you bring in another one, and uh, the track will lined up, and then you're going to slide them both together I mean slide the panel back in to slot both together all right so let's take a closer look at the coffin itself and uh, see on the base there uh, and then there's a translucent rod and a hook here and that piece is removable back panels nice you can see the two lights back there and I think there are one right there and another light right there and two down there and the base structure has a strip of lights oh and then on top there's another light and then the other button basically gives you three blue LED lights to light up your uh, holographic uh, panel there. Turn that off because that's not really useful that often unless you put on put that plexiglass on. And that plexiglass doesn't attach really uh, snap onto anything other than the strip down here. There's a little slot down here, but nothing on top. So when you put it in, basically it's just going to rest onto the figure. So let's take a look at these side panels. Turn the lights. Turn off the lights. And uh, yeah, these side, side panels 
right here and the one on the other side. It's not a really solid structure, but um, it's good enough, I guess. I mean, I understand why, because they do have to remove these panels uh, for you to build all seven of them. So when you put all seven of them together, you can use a power adapter instead of a instead of just a whole bunch of AAA batteries. And uh, yeah, it tells you you can use a I guess for US it will be 110 volt, and for uh, uh, anywhere else it's 220, I think. And uh, yeah, so you need to buy your own power uh, power adapter for this thing. Here is standing next to Mark 1. Let me bring out Mark 7. So would I recommend people buying this? Um, it's okay. I mean, uh, well, individually they are $129 and then uh, if you buy all 7, they're $7.99. Um, uh, if you want to buy one just to check it out, I say, yeah, go for it. Because uh, it is pretty nice. And because um, even if you gonna try to make it yourself it's gonna take a lot of money and a lot of time so for 129 I think it's somewhat worth it because um, uh, for it to look this good yeah you're gonna have to spend a lot of money and a lot of time so yeah and uh, if you if you have all seven and if you have a good setup then uh, your display it's gonna look really 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 nice so yeah uh, at the end of this video I'm going to show some pictures and uh, all seven of them together and uh, and I'll let you guys see what it looks like so yeah there you go thanks for watching